up to pass over there in beautiful old Comiskey Park right there, folks. And you see, that's where the White Sox play. Do you see the design structure of it? It faces southeast. Chicago skyline is that way. The old Comiskey Park just, just opposite over there, over that way, stood the old Comiskey Park. It faced northeast, where it was facing the skyline. Right now, Reinsdorf King, the city of Chicago, state of Illinois for $1 billion to build his stadium. I'm going to show you where it's going to be, where he wanted to build. The old 78. $1 billion. Not just for infrastructure, not just for sewers and water. The whole stadium. $1 billion. Considering all the things that the mounting debt and the mounting problems we have. We want to take a billionaire Build him a stadium that he has one there that's sitting over that is wrong with it. Even though, I will give him, he messed up in the design of it. But it's that building, that, that stadium is not falling apart. Oh, get back with you. Uh, aren't you this is why try to ride it out with cousins or that that you want to pay him and Justin Jefferson. Yeah, these people out here paying him and Justin Jefferson. They don't do it. Well, they don't. Yeah, I, I, for now, for got his kids out there with him paying him. I didn't need that. Dude, dude, right, they got his daughter paying him. Really? Here we are at the other site. Now, he wants to build a stadium just above here, right there, up and above that. That area up above here, I can't get up there because of the fences and stuff. But I, I got, I'm busy now. But right where they'll have that skyline view, right there. That's where you want to be. He want to be probably 300, 400 yards that way. You know, so uh, the state is a prime real estate. But he wants us to build it. Wants the taxpayers of the state of Illinois to give him a billion dollars. Not for just infrastructure, but a billion dollars. Well, how much is he paying? And for this, him being Jewish, and it's a word I learned while I was a teenager working on Maxwell Street in what we call Jewish Town. Fondly called Jewish Town. I said we shortened the word. It was not the mean, not meant to be a derogatory word, but it was a it was a word of fondness. When you said it, we go in there, it's fondness toward them. And some of them, but listen, my thing is this. He's a drek. And that's the Yiddish word that I'm going to label him Jerry Reinsdorf with. He wants to build a stadium, which is prime real estate, which I've been calling for for years. Mayor Richard J. Daly wanted to build a dome stadium like a replica of the New Orleans, uh, what they call it back then, the Superdome. Back in 72, 73, he wanted to open that, a stadium right there for the Bears, the Bulls, for the Bears, the Cubs, and the White Sox. It's not, you know, this is 2024. Reinsdorf has, owns the Bulls, has a new stadium. He owns the White Sox, has a new stadium. The stadium is not even, basically 34 years old. I admit, it's a piece of shit. It, it, you know, it really, it, but it's in good shape. It's not, it's not, it's not falling apart. But it was, he missed the design concept a long time ago. When he first built it, first had it built. They begged him to build a replica of Comiskey Park, the original committee, he said no. So now he found out the year later when Baltimore opened Camden Yard, that was some opportunity he missed. He made the wrong decision. Now he has an opportunity to do it again, but he wants the taxpayers to pay for it when we're not through paying for the one back that way. So I mean like, no, no. No, as much as I love baseball, I love baseball. I'm, that's my sport. I, I love both Cubs and White Sox. It's Chicago baseball team. I have no. I'm, I'm just slightly partial to the Cubs, but I, I, I love the White Sox too. I go to both games. I, all my life, all my life since I was nine years old. Go to ball games all in, whenever I can. Now I can't probably. I can't afford it as much as I used to, but. 
For that reason, no. Screw you. If you want to go to Nashville, go. You're going to threaten us with these stadiums. You're going to taxpayers to pay for it. And you're a multi-millionaire, probably a billionaire. And you can't fuck over, fork over the money to pay for it. You can't raise the money to pay for it. All the taxpayers should be helping you with is the infrastructure, the streets, the roads. You know, sewer, water lines, name it. That stuff. Not, not the stadium. You're damn... You lost your damn mind, cheapskate. 